this man Stefan's trying to troll. <laughs> There's battles in the bases. This nobody's getting anything done. I lied. I said we're out farming. I couldn't have been more wrong. They're throwing Someone spears at each other. <laughs> Nobody farms anymore. They just throw spears. This is nerve free tribe life. What is going on again, Nerf Raiders? Thank you guys so much for coming back to hang out with us today. We're playing some more Ark Survival Evolved over here on the island server, kicking off day two of Game of Obelisks. I'm joined here with Blitzfire 9. I don't know what's going on, Blitzers. What's up? Not a whole lot. We're going to try to start building our castle. We have claimed Green Obelisk as our own. The, uh, the 24 hour claiming period is now completely over, so anybody who's built on the obelisk owns it. And we can start to build our castle. We're getting away from our, our pleb shack. Most of it has been broken down. Foundations have been laid to cover almost entirety of the obelisk. The Tribs has been out working very, very hard, gathering as much stone, wood, and thatch as they can so that we could start doing some more of this. And here is what we're working with. This is going to be the core center of the base, right around the obelisk, just like we're supposed to be doing. Building our obelisk, representing that green color. And we're going to be going forward from here. Blitzes, you want to hop in the smithy? Sure. Let's pull out uh, as many walls as we can. I can't actually carry that many. I'm a little light. And we got to start building our castle to epic proportions. You can see we've already started a little bit just to give ourselves a guide, lay things out. We still need a lot more foundations. Uh, we've It's not really super even terrain. So we used some, the ladder trick and we lined up some like step-like step foundations, which I think looks actually really 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 cool and then we'll uh continue to do that as we build our castle over here now it's not going to be super aesthetically it's going to be aesthetically pleasing i take that back it's not going to be super symmetrical due to the terrain that we're really working with but i'm excited to get this castle build underway and going i am nick guys this is nerd parade welcome to the channel and thank you so much for coming back to hang out with us in game of obelisks how high do you think we should go blitz five or four for the core you yeah. think we should go more than three uh, oh, do you want to do three? I mean, our, our forge will fit in three, what? and then that leaves us room on top. If we have an extra room, we can put another room on top. Three it is. Let's build... Uh, we actually don't need to worry about drop-ins. Yeah, that's so we? nice. Not really. Uh, like Most what? we're going to get is somebody like grapple climbing one of those pillars and parachuting onto a roof. Yeah, yeah. That I mean... Like the most. I don't think... But then they still have to fight down the roof. <laughs> yeah, they'll still have to like beat down the roof. I don't think drop-ins... I mean, I would like to build a couple of layers... But I don't think drop-ins are going to be too terribly ridiculous. Uh, yeah. At least not in this season. We're going to do what we can to honeycomb this. As you can see, we're going to put door frames here. We're like mishmashing, mish mismatching on purpose. I need we're making catacombs. Yes, I need to gamma. Let's go to gamma four. That's a lot better, actually. It was a little too dark. Oh, Blitzers, you messed oh, no. up. Shame upon you and your house. Actually, wait, we're in the same house. Shame upon us <laughs> for building poorly. Oh, do I want to do that? We should put doors on the... Uh... How do we want to do this? There's three. We could put a. We could go with two doors. Two doors on the end? Yeah, and then put a door, like, two doors here. I got it. I don't know. Here. One door here. Since we're making it a little wider, why don't we do this? We'll put the, oh crap we'll put the doors right next to each other because I don't want it to be too like obnoxious but I do want to honeycomb it quite a bit ah oh, tits on my freaking chest <laughs> <sighs> every time every single time are you gonna put two doors there there we go uh I am gonna put my building remote away yeah two right next to each other and not one here in the center make it go around uh yes you there. you've got it okay. you've you've got my you're buying what I'm selling. You're picking up what, what I'm putting down. Quite literally picking up what I'm putting down. Because I'm uh, <laughs> doing bad at it. We're going to have two door frames right here. So let's pop here and here. And then we'll make... Yeah, okay. We're going to castle build the crab out of this. It's going to look really cool. And they're not going to get into the base. That's the song of nobody's going to get into our base this season. Uh, do one, two here. Boom. I'm out of walls. Got to get some more. Yeah, I, to. I just had to get more. More or less, everything's been functioning pretty efficiently. Uh, with the gather rates being so slow, the tribe has been working very, very hard. And we are, so far, progressing pretty well. We've got that little bit of respite now that the, uh, 
the structure damage is is off until Friday, which every Friday will be winter. Winter is coming, hence the theme, Game of Obelisks. Winter is coming every Friday, which will operate exactly the same as our purse. Did you go one too many over here, buddy? Uh, I didn't put that one down. I just put the two on top of it. <laughs> oh, maybe I did it and didn't even realize it. Uh, hello? Building remote game? Thank you. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, no, crap. <laughs> I'm doing so bad. Building is hard. Anyway, as I was saying... Uh, winter will be coming on Friday, every Friday. That will be our purge, and structure damage will be increased. Now, since we're in stone tier all the time, it'll be... Uh, devast cannons will be devastating. Uh, there'll be a lot of a lot of things that are actually pretty, pretty hefty. Fairies will be powerful. Yeah, it'll be interesting to actually see what people come up with. Colloquio theorems will be powerful. Ballistas catapults like yeah it'll be quite interesting i'm just trying to make sure that i built this the same on each side here yeah this one's symmetrical over here except now i don't think you put two doors i yeah, didn't also. yeah it's one on each side i was trying to figure out what the what is different between these two sides you butthole there we go there we go there we go all right the beginning yeah. of our core the is, nerd center the nerd center indeed is coming along we're gonna have to oh, place some ceilings ceiling. down here yeah and then we'll continue to uh, make our base build happen. Sorry, I'm like my oh, words that... are heavy right. We will continue to. Yeah, I'm doing bad. The concentration is real. The concentration is quite <laughs> real. 67 ceilings. All right, we've got enough. We're out of foundations, though. We need... Oh, five. I saw five in there. I just accidentally ripped one, too. Yes, five. Yep. Just need stone. Stone, we're running out of stone like crazy. Everybody's oh. out doing stone runs. We're going to have to go out and do stone runs. This man, Stefan's trying to troll. <laughs> There's battles at the bases. This Nobody's getting anything done. I lied. I said we're out farming. I couldn't have been more wrong. They're throwing Someone spears at each other. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody farms anymore. They just throw spears. This is Nerd Parade Tribe Life. This is how it happens. This is where this is where the magic happens. All right. We're going to get in on this. <gasps> Die. Die. I, I'm going to participate, too. I'm going to kill his monkey. Oh, that's Stefan. I don't mean to kill that man, Stefan. Oh, come back here. He's going to try to troll on me. Not on my watch, sir. I'm too cheeky for you. It's PvP practice. Oh, how did I? I walked right into it. I absorbed it for someone. <laughs> and I got a giant pole sticking out of me. Here we have it. We've got two layers almost completely finished. We're, we ran out of stone. We're going to have to go do some farms. But this is what we're working with. We've done a little bit of feng shui inside. We've got some... We need to make a jerboa pin or something. <laughs> Got our cauldron down. Things are starting to shape up. Uh, we got a dude who's just hanging out here at, up at the top. He's in my way. Because we're going to place some forges down. I'm going to get all these up nice here and lined up. One. Thank you for... <laughs> he's just bobbing. He's, we got a we got a hanging boom from the ceiling. He's dangling there like a dingleberry. Oh, we should call him dingle, a, ding, dingle dingleberry. Boom. We'll call him dingle boom from now on. There you go. And line these all up. We've got enough forges to uh, go all the way across here. I think we could do 13. Yeah, if we do one more here. I oh, we could, <laughs> we could get 13. Did you kill him? Oh, my God. I hit him with the club and I killed him. <laughs> oh, my God. You killed the dingle boom. I'm going to go <laughs> feng shui some more. That poor guy never knew what hit him. It was a blitz. Spoiler alert. Uh, oh, we, we got, got oh, good. We got metal spelt, spelton. We can transition it over. I Hopefully I'm not too fat. Get this stuff out of the open air. We don't need an open air environment anymore. We finally got a base. We're moving up in the world. Oh, they tamed a Thylacolio. Oh, nice. Sir Nipple Twister, 180. Oh, crap. That must have been a high level. Put our building remote away. We haven't even had the chance to get out like do any tame stuff yet. We've been sticking our noses to the grindstone stone, trying to farm. <laughs> How about like... Let's do this like that. They're not super even. These are temporary because we're going to be uh, industrial forging it as soon as they're ready. Should I leave a little? We, I mean, we could put something else up here. I know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do. Okay, I've got it. We're feng shuiing. We're decorating. We're arterior decorators. Okay. We'll leave a spot where we can walk through here in the middle and we're, we'll put like... Something up here in the middle for now. Whatever we happen to make next, I don't know. Maybe we can actually put the beds up there. 
Oh. Yeah. Oh, th see, there you go. Your arterial decorating. Oh, yeah. I'm going to put the beds in the middle there. I actually like that idea. We're going to grab, grab those really quickly. The base is progressing all along. There's going to be a lot of, like, tribe lifey stuff, I feel like, in this uh, series, in this season. Because as we're recording, we were thinking, like, I, at least I was discussing with Blitz. I was like, you know what? I'm a little worried about today's video. And Blitz is like, why, Nicholas? Uh, we can read it. I was like, why, Nicholas? <laughs> why are you worried about today's video? I'm like, thank you for your concern, Blitz. It went exactly like this, by the way. Totally. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Thank you for your concern. You know, I was like, I'm a little worried about the video. You know, we're not making like progress as quick as we normally make. And Blitz is like, bro, you don't need to. And I'm like, it was this crystallizing moment. It's like, oh my God, you're, you're right. Like, we don't need to have some kind of like, oh, okay, next time on Nerd Parade, look is what has happened. And there's going to be a lot of next time on Nerd Parade, not much has happened uh, because the gather rates are so slow and the taming rates are so slow. But we could still make it like fun and entertaining. Like there will be things that change and things that happen around on the base enough for us to get content and episodes on. But I, this is a little bit of a new concept to me because I've always recorded with higher rates and things tend to pro progress relatively quickly. And I think I've gotten a little bit used to that. So this is kind of like, um, uh, breaking me out of my shell a little bit. It's a little, I'm, I'm scared, Blitzes. I don't know if I could do this. <laughs> hold me. I need, hold me, Blitz. I need I you. I need an adult. <laughs> I need an adult for real. We're going to feng shui the crap out of this. Oh, you want to do something like this over here? Because I was thinking we'd just line them all up. Oh, no, like, I was going to do... You got something else in mind? No, you're probably a better interior decorator than I am. I had something like very... Uh, everything is OCD lined up right next to each other. I was talking about the uh, smithy, by the way. And I noticed you're still looking through a finding forge. Oh, the the, the like smithy? the smithy down here. Was oh, that I you? Didn't put that there. Oh, you didn't put that? <laughs> oh, screw that then. We're going with my initial... Uh, <laughs> I was up here doing the, the other three forges. <laughs> We're going with my initial build different. then. No, I appreciate you doing that. We're going to do all these nice, like like so. Oh, there yeah. Go. That okay. looks nice. We can get a third one in there. One more. <laughs> and people will be able to craft up all their stuff. Uh, I'm, I was thinking, oh, you know what? We may move those after all. Why don't we line that thing with the vaults? In the Two. center. Three vaults? Yeah, like three vaults on each of the walls. Oh, I guess this would be three. This one could be six vaults. Oh, I, I get what you're saying. All the way around it. Yeah. Could, yeah. It's going to be a while before we get vaults, though. No, I know, but I'm just trying to plan ahead. We can um, very easily move that stuff. Yeah. But we could put the smithies up here on top. Yeah. And make this our crafting area. That wouldn't be a bad idea, especially because if our... forges aren't going to go up here. No. If our vaults are in the core center of the base, they're, gonna, like, they're not going to breach through here... And knock down a vault. You right. feel me? Like I'm they trying to, to get in and then break down the vaults. Yeah, yeah. I'm, tr I'm like trying it. to think. Like what could be the most? Um... I like that. And we could even like ramp this off so it's an extra layer. Like yeah. the, our guys would have to go in through here if they needed to get into a vault. I don't know. That might be really annoying. I, I take that back. I'm thinking it's out loud. Annoying, but annoying is what deters raiders. That is true. That is true. You make it as annoying as possible. It'll deter a raider. A raider. <laughs> raider. Raider. I'm popping outside to take a look at more of what we've done. We've got... Oh, they're starting to do spikes. Nice. Oh, God, that's going to eat through our hide like nobody's business. <laughs> it's so... Like, with one times gather rate, resource management is so, like... Uh, like, it, this is this is rough. But we've got so many people contributing to things. We're going to be building the Nerd Picasso, for sure. It's not going to be symmetrical, but we're going to be making, like, pillars. I'm gonna, I want to make a pillar here. Another pillar, like, over there. Sniping stuff. It's going to be pretty darn cool. We've already got, like, a Teen Titan-looking tower over here. We're going to have to fix that, put another pillar here. I want, like, the four pillars of the castle. And then we'll have, like, courtyard for dino stuff. We'll have the beneath area. Like, I don't want to hop down, but I'll show you in a second. We're going to get some more foundations here. We've just got a lot of room to work with in this small space. And we do not have clipping enabled this season. All vanilla structures, so this is all very easily buildable with uh, on, on pretty much any server. But I'm going to hop down now. All this down here we can use for dino storage. Uh, build pins down there so our dinos aren't getting sniped or just taken out while we're offline. You know, whatever the case. I feel like, I feel good about this spot. I feel good about the green obelisk. We came here because we wanted to get started quickly. It was the quickest obelisk we could reach. But I'm thinking it might have been an accidental strategic, uh, an accidental good strategic choice.
I agree. I, I'm I'm very excited about this. Some more plans. I w- I'm planning to build up pretty tall with this, the center point of the tower. We'll have our four pillars and make this whole thing look like a, a really cool castle. But this is all food for thought. This is just where I'm painting you the future picture with my imagination mind brush, hoping that you can see what I'm... Hopefully you're buying what I'm selling. Hopefully you're building what I'm castling. Does that work? No, I don't think that works. <laughs> <laughs> We've got to continue to do a little bit more feng shuiage here. I'm going to take some of these uh, mortar pastels. Oh, Stefan, that man is picking up what I'm putting down. He is picking up. He's Or Blitz, you're picking up what I'm putting down here. One more <laughs> pestle. Awesome. And I, I'm going to go up here. This will be the first time I've actually gone up this. I don't know what this is. Is this supposed to be like a log out room? Is I it, don't know. Is it's it got a windows. snipe it's tower? A tower? Okay. It's not even, It's an incomplete snipe tower. There's not even a roof here. There's a jump snipe on this one. <laughs> yeah. We, oh, oh, yeah. We'll teach you. <laughs> I've actually kind of enjoyed the, the scramble in the beginning. When's the last time that you built in thatch? Never. <laughs> yeah, me either. Like, we dropped, know, server. we dropped thatch, and then we dropped wood. And we're still kind of utilizing some wood stuff because we're s- scrambling to get stone for our castle. This is such... It feels so new and fresh, almost like a, a bit of a new game. And this, that is why I love doing these themes. Like the Game of Obelisk theme, it may, it turns arc, uh, and like I was expressing a little while ago, something that we many of us have thousands upon thousands of hours in, and spins it into a new game, and we're not really even utiliz- utilizing uh, some like core changing mods or anything. So it could be pretty uh, enjoyable for all. But enough of my ramble nanigans, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you're liking the way that the castle is turning out. If you are, please smash the thumbs up button for me. Boom, boom. Let me know that you like the stuff. Blitz is... Uh, bungee jumping me along the way i'm worried i might start taking fall damage from this this is kind of funny <laughs> let me know that you like this stuff guys if you haven't done so yet please subscribe to the page for some more cool videos just like this one but this changes me <laughs> i don't want you to miss any of the game of obelisk season it's going to be crazy we're going to get built up there's going to be purge or i'm sorry winter will be coming every friday and we'll be open world pvping almost every single day thank you guys so much again for watching please remember to take care of yourselves all right go ahead <laughs> yes! Like button punched. Please remember to take care of yourselves, stay awesome, and we'll catch you in the next episode.